I bring her coffee in bed every every morning. That's kind of like, that's one of my, I, I think to me, like a, something that, um, it's like my, my first act of love for the As what appears to be a suicide, Stephen Twitch Boss has passed away at the mere age of 40 years old, leaving behind his wife and three kids as a legacy. According to a recent post that has surfaced online, Stephen left a very significant clue that depicts that he had thought out the entire process of going away before actually going ahead with it. As saddening as it is, let's look at the details of what actually took place. According to other sources close to the celebrity's family, Stephen Twitch Boss set his phone to airplane mode, left a suicide note at a motel referencing difficulties he had previously faced and then shot himself in the head. Only one mile from his home, the 40-year suicide old scene had the cryptic message. According to TMZ, around 10.30 a.m. on Monday, Boss, a veteran executive producer of The Ellen DeGeneres Show, checked into the Oak Tree Inn in Encino. The day after he failed to check out, he was discovered dead in the bathroom of his hotel. Additionally, which cited law enforcement sources, Boss' wife of nine years, Allison Halker, called the Los Angeles police on Tuesday to report him missing, claiming he had disappeared without a trace the day before and wasn't responding to her calls. Whereas just three days after their wedding anniversary, Halker said there had been no argument or confrontation that led to his leaving, as she claimed his lack of communication was strikingly out of character. To look for any leads regarding his absence, police further went with Halker back to the family home. However, not long after, a 911 call came in from a nearby motel where a housekeeper had discovered Boss dead from a gunshot wound. Although contacted on Thursday by DailyMail.com regarding the situation, an LAPD spokeswoman declined to comment. Big smile. Not to mention he was a genius at freestyle. Boss returned as an all-star and met his wife, Allison Holker. Together, they raised three children. It was The Ellen Show that propelled him to another level of fame. Sayeth, 3, Maddox Laurel, 6, and Wesley Renee, 14, who was born in Allison's previous relationship but was adopted by Stephen, entered the three children that Boss, 40, and Halker, 34, had together. In a moving statement on Wednesday, she paid tribute to him and promised to save the last dance for him. I spent it like three weeks in, I was like, even if you need a second, but like for me, like I already know you're my one. Allison said, I love you first. We were in Montgomery, Alabama, it's my hometown. On the other hand, according to the manager of the motel, Rakish gave his statement to the LAPD officer stating, he went into his room and he never came out. At 11.15 a.m. on Tuesday, the maid opened the door to check on the room. There was his stuff in there, but no one there. She checked the bathroom and there was blood everywhere. She was very scared. This is the first time anything like that has happened here. We called 911 and they told us to check his pulse, but there was nothing. The paramedics and the police came and they said he was dead. Rakesh, who only wants to be addressed by his first name, added that neither visitors nor workers heard the gunfire. As per his statement, maybe he did it during the day on Monday. It's a busy, loud road outside here, it's possible nobody heard it because of that. On Monday, it has also been reported that Boss had called ahead at around 9.20 a.m. to see if rooms were still available, then he had walked a few blocks from his house. He appeared totally normal and calm, according to the manager. That being said, there were no signals that the DJ was struggling in the weeks leading up to his passing, according to Stephen Twitch boss grieving grandfather. Before his passing, he made sure to send his grandfather an I love you dad dad text message and posted a birthday greeting to him on social media four days earlier. According to Eddie Boss, 84, there were also no indications of stress in the weeks or months before his death. Of course, everyone seems to be quite shocked after the DJ shot himself but his oldest daughter is thought to be the most affected one. Wesley, who is scheduled to attend Notre Dame University with the class of 2026, has had her promising future overshadowed by the suicide, as stated on a notice on the family's front lawn. She also participates in modeling for athletic gear and is a young influencer for companies like her parents' Dick's Sporting Goods. For his involvement with the shows Ellen and So You Think You Could Dance, he was very popular on both of those. The LAPD says Boss died by suicide on Tuesday. He was only 40 years old. Errol Barnett takes a look back on the life of a man known for his ever-present smile and seemingly boundless energy. I love, I love your dance moves. Oh, thank you. I love your dance moves, too. A pillar of positivity and motivation. Stephen Boss earned the nickname Twitch as a child because he never seemed to stop moving. A multi-talented and charismatic dancer. That's all for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Goodbye.